hello guys hello hello once again this is me again i'm back at it i'm about to show you guys how to add audio to your event real quick so before i move on so make sure you subscribe and turn on your notification whenever um i post something so you can get notified um once again welcome to explosion 360 photo booth um, i'm wally i'm about to show you quick how to add audio okay so let's get to it very quick all right so now let's say here you here um you are at your event you already do all your setup i mean i just named this audio okay you do all your setup your countdown everything already set for you um all you need to do is add your audio everything already set okay so we're just gonna go on the audio section but before we do that there's one thing you have to do i use youtube as one source because you see there's this one right here it's a non-copyright um, background so I'm about I already played so I'm about to use about 3.4 3.5 second out of it all right so what you do you copy this you copy this all right you go to um, I go to this side it's called um, YouTube to mp3.net okay so I paste it right here and I convert it so that's like a mp3 um mp4 to mp3 it's converting right now so write this down youtube or you can just tap u to mp3.org or um youtube youtube number two mp3.net okay that's where you go you use that to convert it whatever video whatever link you pick up whatever um song you pick up from youtube to convert it all right so now when it's ready you see that's the website right here so i highlight it right here so you can see it you see youtube this all right so you see download all right so you can allow it to access to your um, um you allow it to access to get access to the download um to your computer as long as you not download anything extra okay so now when i'm done here so i move to online mp3 quarter of it is called audio trimmer.com you see audio trimmer.com right here audio trimmer.com all right you can even convert a song here if you like to but right now we're just gonna trim it all right so we're just gonna trim go back so we're gonna go back all right so so now you on audio trimmer Okay, let's go back to the beginning of it. Why is doing this to me? Okay, there you go. When you hear, you select, you choose file. Okay, so now that's the song that I download right here. I paste it. So let's say I download this one. All right, I download this one. So I, you can go ahead and you see right now it's processing. So now when it's ready, you can either you can even play it and listen to it. So you see. So let's say I want it from the beginning, but I don't need the whole song. I just need a section of it. So let's stop it right here. So now when I select the section I need, so I click co-op. So you see when it's ready, it say download. Now it's download, right? So when it's download, you go back to the event, and then now I'm ready to select the song. So you see, you choose file. You know that's the new one so you see it's about 1.1 megabyte um or this one probably even shorter that's the one i crop right so when you crop it you click upload okay when you upload it and then you go all the way down you submit okay after you submit now you can go to designer make sure you add your overlay okay first thing I'm going to do always select your template first and upload since I use Canva to design my overlays and I go ahead and select my overlay upload and click it and move over always make sure you can see this white man in the middle of the screen that's when your overlay is transparent you see audio that's the event add template all right so I add my template so after I add my template one thing I like to do I go back to the event make sure my audio and my overlay is there you see overlay click on it it open like this that's mean my overlay is there perfect now I'm gonna go back and now I want to go back to edit make sure my audio is there okay before I do anything else you see my audio is there so I click on it and it plays. it's about 42 seconds which is perfect 
which is perfect so not too long i don't like to keep my audio too long because that's that would take too much space that would keep the software too busy i don't like to do that so after i confirm all that make sure my audio is there and then i resubmit it again now it give me the barcode i can always click on it all right and then let me show you a quick way to always get back to the barcode is if i'm right here and i need the barcode i can just click on it just keep in mind when the event is complete all the way you don't get this barcode anymore i always take a picture of it just in case if something happens so i have it on my other phone to close my event okay guys so plain and simple this is how you add audio first you need youtube to pick the song you need youtube to number two mp3.net to convert it into mp3 and download it and you need audio trimmer.com to co-op it to trim it down i don't like to use the whole song and you go back to um your event and then you upload it that's pretty much how you do it guys if you have any question please feel free to leave a comment i will be glad to answer whatever question you may have remember follow explosion 360 photo booth i will always come here and post good stuff to help you out thank you again for watching have a lovely day